I must have caught a spot, have I? My bloody beard. Yeah, I have.
Hello, right there we go. Right. Controller link. friend Right, we're gonna go and do. Oh, what's that? Oh, companion. Oh. Arthur, oh Arthur, 
You're the only one of these fools knows just how lost he is. I know the truth. I know the truth. Now I've done that. I'm gonna go and see Jose. Can't do him yet. Oh, the Mandalorian. I know that's chapter 4, that. Yeah, I'm on YouTube, Dan. Hello. Do it on it on the um, PlayStation. Um, while he's doing that, you can still look at the map. I mean, you can't do it on here. I ain't no such thing. Prospective new partner, if he likes this. Liking ain't the problem. Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voices down. I don't want my boss here. This is a sideline. Of course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. I tell you what. Let us prove ourselves. Prove ourselves to this Kyle what you're talking about. Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business dealings. Listen. He's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. An old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not idiots. Let us prove it to you. Okay. I'll tell you what. Arthur, 
Old Bob Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. It's in their barn. Hey, you go get that. And then we can work together. Who's old Bob Crawford? An acquaintance of mine. So you want us to take out your competition? Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin by marriage. I also want to see if you boys got what it takes. Hey, you survived that. Where is he? Well, he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Carmody Dell. It's just up the train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. There's also some money in that house, but that's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more. They'll know it was me. But you're fine with us, Robin, because Sorry. marriage. Yes, Sorry. I love it. You heard the man. Let's go rob his cousin uh, yeah. by marriage. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm on YouTube, Dan. I am. So I'm on YouTube. My stage seems to work better on there, Dan. I'm, I said I'm on YouTube. My stage seems to work better on that. This works. Come on, Jose. Yeah. <laughs> and that's why he's perfect. Yeah, it is. Don't cause us any problems. A safe spot to fence wagons and coaches, that's easy money. Does it tell you that I, I go live down on my YouTube? Or not? Like he's asking us to rob a bank. If the two of us can't steal a stagecoach, it don't always work, I take it. Good cousin by marriage, we should hang up our hats now. Oh yeah. So what's the story with that Emerald Ranch? You trying to add anything else? A little. Owner's a nasty type by all accounts. Seamus is sure scared of him. That's not saying much. Something strange about the place. Used to be a saloon there, a general store. Now it's all closed up, but they seem to have money. Sounds worth a look around. For sure. Seamus also mentioned the rancher's daughter a couple of times. No. Oh, I used to it's see her all the time. Oh, it's, it's, it's in game, it's in game mode. Oh, it's just sweet on her. It is. That's what you call finding out a little. Once it opens up, you see Seamus does like to talk. Hopefully not too much. Yeah, yeah, you're in the loo with me, I just needed the toilet. Hey, imagine you did it and you've got his on video chat. Oh, sorry, man. Yeah, That must be the place up ahead. We should go on foot from here. Let's see what we're dealing with. Come on. Yeah. There's the house. You see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. Sneak in, then I'll get the coach. You can try the house. What do you think? Let's wait. Let's do night time, shall we? Okay, let's go. Sure. Go into the house. I'll go find this wagon.
and get as much as we can. We love them, you do that. Yeah. Even though we... Quickly. Uh, 
else work, Jose? It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Sure. Good 
by fans. Polar, some polar drinks. Like the ways of the bay, yeah, the best. The pier had to flock out of the ground to tumble and roar. The face was as red as a lobster. Goodbye, fair. I fell and broke my poor knobster. I'll watch you as it from my first word will go. I'll never get drunk, boys. We're bound to go. I'm resolved to try it. Good there, Pearson. Still need more food, Mr. Morgan. Yeah, you should try your luck again with that bow. I know. I will. Chopping it down. We'll all be watching you. Right, we're gonna go help. We're gonna get my car out. Get him out of jail. A bit of action now, in a minute. A bit of action. Come on, girl.
Come on, walk a bit faster. You're holding traffic up. Last one. some sort of incident. We don't deal with bounty hunters around here, son. I, I was just wondering if I could get a description. Well, they weren't friends. They got into a fight, two men got killed. Now, one of them's an idiot, the other's some kind of dumb mick, so maybe them's your boys. You can look right enough when we hang them. six months. Now, I got an opportunity to watch you be silenced. Well, you gotta do something. Why? I always looked up to you, Arthur. Well, that's your first mistake. Listen, there's one little problem. There's only one of me, and there's a whole town full of people wanting to see you swing. You got to do something, Arthur. This wall just needs some good force. Yes! Hook that over the bars and see if you can pull them off! What a modern disaster this is gonna be. Just pull that lever. Come on. Ha <laughs> 
Let's get out of here. There was some good shooting, Morgan. Whew. I gotta hand it to you. What the hell was that you pulled back to? Gotta be wild, all right. Wild. A bit. Making a house call in the middle of all that <laughs> ain't much I care about more than those guns. That uh, yeah. much is clear. Who was that fella? Skinny? Yeah. We ran together for a while. Did a bank job down south. Didn't end well. I saw how goddamn ended. He was gonna let me have it. I'm starting to wish I had. And you owe Lenny too. If he hadn't found us in time. Yes, you will all be thanked profusely. I promise. Yeah, well, you're lucky Dutch has got you back. Some unknown reason. Oh, there. I think we finally lost. I hope so. I'm giving you a holster. It's my way of saying thank you. And thank you. There I was having a dull day only for you. Liven it up by letting me help you shoot up half the town. <laughs> You're a funny fellow, Arthur. Real funny. Why you act all sour all the time? Well, you ain't funny at all. So why you gotta act like the court chest? Right, listen, I'm sorry, but we're family now. Arthur, you and me, sons of Dutch, makes us brothers. Sometimes brothers make mistakes. I'm heading back to my little camp where I'm back at Strawberry. Come see me. Maybe I can make things up to you. You ain't heading back to Dutch? No, I've been a bad boy, Arthur. I ain't seeing Dutch so I can bring him a peace offering. <clears throat> Bye now. Yeah. good men out there. Make yourself one of the good ones. Thanks, mister. I hope you're right. You wait, Millie May. Someday, I'll show you how to be rich.
good lacking. We won't get much for it. Many thanks, Mr. Morgan. Arthur, don't forget, I'm more than happy to craft you something if you bring me the right materials. Is that? happy to borrow off someone like me, but more enthusiastic paying back to someone like you, of course. Who are they? Hmm, let me see. A Chick Matthews works at Guthrie Farm. He's a hand, I believe. Mr. Roble, the small holder at Painted Sky, runs the operations there, badly. Miss Lily Millet is a ranch maid up at Emerald Ranch. The hair was made believe in Duchess Bluster about us helping folk. It's legal work, Mr. Morgan. Debtors belong in prison. We are doing them a favor. Right. I'll make sure they see it in their terms. Put the debts in the deed box and try not to kill them. It's very bad for business. Yes. 
she is. Good book. I'm allowed to take a break, Arthur. See where we gotta go. gift to us all focuses the mind like nothing else whatever you say well I say why buy it off the shelves when you can make your own well plenty left here if you're interested I best keep moving well shit thanks I guess Proszę, co pan robi w moim domu? God damn it. English? Uh, you speak English? Me? Uh, Silesia. Yeah, good uh, for Silesia. I'm here for money. Do you borrow from a German man? Ah, uh, uh, German. Uh, um, uh, mein Herr, uh, uh, sprechen das, uh, this, uh, uh, no. the Kaiserreich. I don't yeah? speak German neither. I'm here for money. 
money that you borrowed from Leopold Strauss. Uh -huh. Aha, uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. Leopold Strauss. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah. So it's time to pay. Yeah, Where is it? I am, yes. Well, no, I have nothing. It's a very bad winter. <laughs> We've all had a bad winter, pal. Where is it? No. Now, you remember where you're keeping that silver? Potrzebuję trochę czasu. Znajdę ci pieniądze. No, still don't understand you. God damn it, you have a debt to hair Strauss. Pay up. Stop! Już nie mam siły. We'll take whatever we can. People over there. Oh my god. Yep.
might as well go back to the thing first, why not? Things better around here. How did you get on, Hal Morgan? Called in on the small holder, Robo. Didn't even speak English. Good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, Mr. Down. The opinionated little do gooder? Hey, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, it's a pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. Nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. I know. I know. <laughs> oh, I should have done the other ones as well, then. Do these two first and then come back. We're going to get the money. Nice and smooth then. Stream's going alright. So What's he need help with Dan? Huh? 
Come on. Put me real big, huh? Aha! That's a good call, amigo. Alright, real simple. First one to win four flying birds wins. Stand near me, and as soon as they come out, it's anyone's shot. Be patient. Ah! There they go! Shoot! There's loads of stuff that I didn't do before in this game. I think we're taking more of the landscaping this time than what I did before. Like what's going on around me and talking to people a lot more. Because these are close to one another, I'll do these first and then I'll go do the other one.
hidden. Come to me, and I'll tell you where it is. God damn, treasure hunt? You're lucky I ain't taking your teeth as well. Come on, this ain't right. If something should happen to me, my worldly possessions are stored here. Tree. Come on, girl. You can say that, mate. Bye. <laughs> Round here, wasn't he? There he gone. He's gone. Come on, girl. Well, where's that other one? There's another one round here, wasn't he? Yeah, there we go. Oh, what's that? Oh, a letter. Oh, we've got a letter, okay. Right, we're going. Yeah. I'll right, go do this one. Go back to camp. Give away the items for the debt. And then we'll read, we'll read that letter. Oh, come on! Why is that always 
gotta be such a goddamn performance for you. Now, I told you I'd get you the money next week, and I'll get it. If you didn't make it this week, who's to say? Lily, where's our money? What? That loan you took. It's payday. I'm sorry. I don't have it right now. Well, then, I guess we got a big problem, don't we? Cooper, give him what you've got. I ain't giving him nothing except the rest of the damn money. <laughs> Oh, I can't pay it off. Damn it. I um, need to get back to... Where's the camp? Oh, yeah. To me. It's me, Hart. Hitch up the horse.
Level five. Oh no, I need to. Um, where's the donation box here? Oh, yeah. Okay. Trophy. I know I said when we last spoke and I was going off to get married that we would not speak again. I know I said a lot of things and I meant them, I suppose, at the time. But I'm not so proud as to not speak to people who care for me or cared for me. I've been in Valentine for a couple of months. I had some bad luck and, well, it's a long story and not an interesting one. But I am here for now. I saw a couple of the girls, or whatever the polite term is for them, that ran with you and your associates in town. And I heard tell of a man who sounded like you. I would love to see you again, if you could spare me a little bit of your time. I'm renting a room at Chadwick Farm, just north of Valentine. Yours, Mary Linton. Is more. What clothes do I have? Outfits. Oh, that one. Let's see Mary, shall we? Mary from the dairy. And while we go this way, as well, we'll pay off our debt at the. Oh, we've got stuff anyway at the post office. Saved it now, bum. Bummer. Uh uh. <laughs> I was not expecting that. Bam. Yeah. 
Haare mit. partner. Send a letter. Where's, uh, where's what's his name? Died. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, me too. Me too. Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh, why well, you been. <clears throat> you been made a widow and you come here looking for me? Is that it? No, ain't like that, Arthur. Huh? Okay. Listen, Arthur, I, I'm, my family, I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? You want me to help? It's my little brother, Jamie. I always liked Jamie, at least compared to the rest of them. He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart. Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my life, me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. Little Jamie's joined the Chelonians, that strange religious order. Good for him. They're quite mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family. But it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but but I think of you often. A long time ago now. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life and not the nightmare that his daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. Please, Arthur. Will you help me? Where is it? Somewhere out 
near Carmody Dell, I think. The rancher there said he'd seen him around the Cumberland Forest. I just want him back, Arthur. If you find him, bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I can do. I'll owe you. You already owe me. to the camp um, and I'm going to save it because I'm going to go get some food yeah yes darling I am in a minute I'm just I'm just saving For your dumb ass.
17. Not bad. Right. That's what I'm going to do, peeps. Um, I think I'm going to leave it there. Thank you everyone that stopped by the stream, the stadia. Um, I will be trying to stream some more uh, stadia games um, when it works. <laughs> like when I can get it to like the stream to work and now I mean stadia works, I just meant stream in general sometimes. I'm sorry. Well I suppose he'd do the same for you. Um we're all in this together, Mr. Morgan. But I yeah. know you know that. Of course, Miss Grimshaw. But yeah, thank you everybody. And I'll see you... <laughs> Excuse me. Next time. Okay? Thank you very much everybody. Bye for now.